Hello beautiful people, welcome back to the space. It's your girl Chito here again. If you're seeing my face for the very first time, you're very much welcome. My name is Chito and today we are talking about remedies for a dry vagina. This video is based on my personal experience as someone who has gone through several boots of hormonal imbalance, dry and deserty vagina during pregnancy and after. Okay, so what are dry vaginas? Dry vagina is simply that stage where your vagina is void of all the sliminess and the juiciness a vagina is supposed to have. Like for example, your vagina are to give that pleasure and um, easy access to you and your spouse when you guys are at that happy stage but it doesn't happen rather it causes friction loss of interest in sex soreness during and after intercourse or even bleeding and it is totally not um limited to just the woman having a dry vagina having going through the soreness even men feel soreness too when your vagina is void of all the juices it's supposed to have during the intercourse even your partner goes through that pain and soreness okay so how did i conquer um going through that desert stage of time first i had to lose that baby weight i had to lose that extra pound because weight is one disadvantage of the body the woman body is so delicate how much more the vagina and um weight weight gain plays a huge role in dropping down your or lowering your estrogen levels and anything that plays or interferes with your estrogen levels be rest assured that your vagina is going to get chapped dry and itchy so i had to lose that extra baby weight okay another remedy is keeping yourself hydrated all through the day water keeping yourself hydrated is not just you drinking water it plays a huge role by circulating all through your body and keeping down moisture in your body and down to your lady areas okay another thing that helps me is stopping all forms of scented lubricants um pads tampons douches panty liners um, scented soaps and stuffs that women want to use to make their vagina smell like strawberry or, or bananas. It is totally okay for your vagina to smell like a vagina. So allow it smell like a vagina. Stop applying foreign or introducing foreign things that your body ordinarily are not used to. It dries up all the moisture of the vagina, takes out the slimy parts of the vagina and leaves you dry as a desert. Another remedy to having a healthy, balanced, slimy vagina is stopping all forms of hormonal birth controls and opting for the non-hormonal one. Anything that has to do with hormones will always mess up your normal hormones in your body and you don't want anything messing up with your hormones that you don't even know when you're supposed to have a period or when your period is supposed to end. Like your system is totally messed up. I've gone through this before and I quickly by myself had to go and stop or take out every form of birth controls I had on okay exercises is another remedy to having a healthy and balanced vagina so when i was pregnant i was never in the mood for um bedroom matters because i i just felt this loss of interest i i, I was not interested never never interested i know yeah it comes with pregnancy but even after pregnancy even after having my baby i was still in the same boat but how did i conquer it i had to incorporate exercises into my daily activities Activities. Exercises and physical activities play a huge role in circulating blood around and within your lady parts. Mm? And another benefit of exercises is it increases your libido. So if you've had this loss of interest in sexual activities or bedroom matters, it is very, very good for you to incorporate exercises. 30 minutes a day is totally fine for you. Do kegels as a woman. Any heat heat exercises that puts your body in in a painful stage and keeps you refreshed is something that you will want to try and trust me your libido will go from here 
to hear. Thank you so much guys for watching this remedies on how I was able to overcome that desert stage of a vagina and if you have things that worked for you please don't forget to leave it in the comment section as we are all learning from each other. Okay thank you so much and until next Friday when we come for another sit down videos I remain your baby girl Chitu. Peace out.